three operating systems that make NSA agents cry themselves to sleep. Onix, Tails, and Cubes all promise ultimate privacy, but they're about as similar as a submarine, spaceship, and tank. Each solves different problems in wildly different ways. Tails is the disappearing act. Boot from USB, browse anonymously through Tor, shut down, and poof, zero digital footprints. Everything routes through Tor automatically, your RAM gets wiped, and there's literally nothing left behind. It's designed for journalists, activists, or anyone who needs to vanish online completely. The catch? You're starting fresh every single time. No saved passwords, no persistent anything, unless you specifically configure it. Onix takes a different approach. It splits your system into two virtual machines. One acts as a gateway that only connects to Tor, the other is your actual workstation. Even if malware completely compromises your workstation, it can't leak your real IP because it literally can't see outside the Tor network. It's like having a digital clean room. But it needs a host operating system to run on, requires more technical knowledge, and demands serious hardware specs. Then there's Cubes, the absolute unit of privacy systems. Edward Snowden uses it, which should tell you something. Instead of trying to make one secure system, it isolates everything into separate virtual machines. Your work email runs in one VM, personal browsing in another, banking in a third. If one gets compromised, the others stay clean. Color-coded window borders show you exactly which security level you're operating in. It's incredibly powerful, but requires learning an entirely new way to use computers. The reality check? Tails is easiest, but most restrictive. Wanix offers the best Tor integration, but needs another OS. Cubes provides maximum security, but has the steepest learning curve and highest hardware requirements. For most people wanting basic anonymity, Tails wins. Need persistent, anonymous computing? Wanix on a Linux host. Working with state-level threats or highly sensitive data? Cubes is worth the complexity. Each serves different threat models. Choose based on your actual needs, not paranoia levels.